Hey guys, this is Kevin from Today's Technical Connect. And today we're going to check out Apple's new OS, Mac OS Sierra. Let's see what this is all about, huh? The addition that you guys might realize first is Siri. You can get to it three different ways. One is with the icon up here, and it works just the same way you would think it would. Hey Siri, what's the weather? Here's the forecast for the today and the 6th of July, 2016. You can also get to it down here in the dock, or you can hit the function space key. I picked a British male accent. Wanted to go with something a little bit different. Also, the notifications window is a little bit more translucent in this version. It looks pretty nice. Now, I did notice with my Twitter widget, it's cutting off the beginning part of all the trending topics, but this is just a beta, guys, so it's something you have to deal with. Also new is the name, Mac OS Sierra, no more OS X. And it's version 10. Dot, it's version 10.12 and it's still in beta. This is actually a developer preview. The um, public beta will be released in July and the uh, full version will be released to the public in September. Another addition is storage. In the new storage utility, you have a manage button, which lets you get a glimpse of how much space you're using on your hard drive. It breaks down all the space into different components from documents to iCloud, photos, and mail. You can turn on erasing trash automatically every 30 days. You can optimize storage, and this would save space by automatically removing iTunes cache from albums and things like that. You can even store your files from your desktop and all your documents into the cloud, which is a new feature that will save you a lot of space. If you hit the review files button, it gives you a snapshot of your largest files, downloads, and even a file br browser to see what folders are taking up how much space. Another feature is picture in picture mode. Like the last scene of the Titanic. If you right click Where and right click one more time, you get this option, enter picture in picture. And this will go on top of any folder that you have open. So anything that you have, you can go over. You can resize the window, you can pause it, or you can redock it back into the original state. iTunes has a new feature called For You that gives you personalized recommendations of music that you would enjoy. In the new Photos app, you can search your photos by the objects and scenery in them, and memories can create slideshows from your existing photos. Apple Pay is now streamlined into macOS, finally. So guys, all in all, macOS Sierra comes with a lot of continuity enhancements for your Apple Watch and your MacBook. It seemed like a great update, and it will be available to everybody in September of 2016. So help me out guys, hit that like button and make sure you subscribe for more content. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Peace. A new desktop that we're welcomed by. A beautiful picture of mountains. Very serenitizing. Is that really a word? My laptop is about to die. So I'm gonna have to charge this and come back to you guys in a few minutes.